Hi, welcome to Tech Tips and Tech Stuff. My name is Ron, and today we're going to learn about Multiply Mask. Multiply Mask is available in Vegas Pro and also Movie Studio. So if you have any one of those programs, you can do what we're doing here today on those programs. And Multiply Mask is a real powerful tool that gives real cool looking effects. So let's begin. Uh, before we begin, you're going to hear this hissing sound in the background. Uh, where I live, we have hundreds of wildfires burning. Uh, the, the air outside is just terrible to breathe. It's just, just full of smoke. You can see the visibility is like one or two kilometers. And your eyes burn when you go outside and you, your throat gets irritated from all the smoke. So everything is just bone dry. I've had hardly any rain. So we're watering all the trees and grass. And it's just, it's just uh, really, really dry. So let's get back to the tutorial here. So the first clip is just of uh, a beach. It's a real nice looking beach. But let's insert some text media in here. I call this Vacation. Change the font to my favorite font. Impact. And always use a scale up. The scale up is the best tool to use, especially when you're doing certain special effects. It won't show artifacts around the sides of the fonts, where if you use the font, you can get artifacts. Let's so make this the full length of the video. Okay, so let's change this to multiply mask. So under compositing mode, select multiply mask. Let's animate this. So put the cursor right about here. Drag this all the way into the A. So you play it back. It zooms in. Revealing a video in behind. So that's a cool looking effect. So let's put this back to source alpha. And here we have a video of a fall setting where leaves are falling on the ground. So a pretty video. We have a transparent image of a model. So make this a full length of the track. Go to event pan and crop and change this to 69 widescreen. Go to compositing mode. Select multiply mask. Now we have a double exposure effect. Gives a real cool looking effect. Okay, so let's turn this back to source alpha. So here we have a video. Somewhere in the outdoors. And here we have a, a puff of dust. So holding the control key down. Time stretch this to make it the full length of the video. So on its own, it's just a puff of dust. But go to compositing mode, change the multiply mask. And now it reveals the video in behind. So you can use this with lots of different effects. There's lots of different um, uh, ink bleeds and uh, different effects out there that will multiply mask will work revealing the video in behind as well. The last one here, let's go to Neo Generators, go to Legacy Text.
call this test. I'm going to change this to my favorite font. Yep, impact. And scaling, I'm going to scale up quite large. Go back to source alpha. So the background is just pretty colors. We can change it to multiply mask. You can use this for introductions to videos. Gives a real cool effect to the text. You can use any kind of video. But you can also change the color of the background too. So let's go back to media generator. Let's go to solid color. Let's pick out um, pick out orange. And the link is visible. Make compositing child. We have an orange background. Going back into the text settings. Let's add a drop shadow. It gives it a cool looking effect. All you have to do is experiment with it. Experiment with Multiply Mask and you can create all sorts of really cool videos. If you found this video helpful, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and thanks for watching.